Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How's everything? Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Everything great? Everything good? <clears throat> yes. Yes. I right. I feel so good. I feel so good. Da, 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 da. <laughs> okay. Like All some... right. Let me see. I'm not quite sure whether I have to do this. 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 Okay, I'm trying to change the background. Give me just one minute, please, while everybody gets to the meeting. Okay. I think it's this one then. Okay. Let's see if it is this one, this one, this one. Okay, give me one second. That's because this one says beginner three and it has to be beginners two, right? Okay. Welcome everybody. I see everybody's ready to rock and roll to have a class. And that's awesome. Let me just have this one is the correct one. Mm -hmm. One second, please. All right. All right, all right. Mr. Oscar Aguirre, how are you? How was your day? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, currently, I feel so pretty good, but the rest of the day, very, very, very tired. <laughs> now you start recovering energy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, great. Nice. Any interesting news today? No. Good news? No. The, the same daily the routine. Same, the same daily routine. <laughs> okay, actually, that teacher, is something. Yes. Teacher, by the way, I apologize to you for asking in your chat, right? No, it's all right. No worries. Don't mention it. It's okay. Yeah, the thing is that uh, I have to explain to you that sometimes I'm not able to answer immediately because uh i got another job during the day so most of the time i'm pretty busy and today we don't have very good news because many of the students got covid you know they got positive for covid and many of their family got positive well some of the colleagues got positive as well so it was kind of a terrible day <laughs> that's why i asked okay. you for good news <laughs> so, okay. I, yes. I guess so Yes, we don't need this kind of positive, you know, we need negative in this case, but anyway, it was, yeah. that's the reality, so that's why, but it's okay, uh, I bet there are so many people, uh, te technicians in the, in the group that will be willing to help you, and that's great, so sometimes if I don't answer, they will answer, okay, so that's great, okay. no worries, okay. Well, welcome. It's the latest class we have at 9 p.m. <laughs> okay, let me just uh, let me just get the correct PowerPoint because I have another class before. So let me just get it. Let's just get it. And let's close the other one. This one. Hold on. Yes. Well, I'm sorry about the, the dogs around here. Sometimes they're not even my dogs, you know. Sometimes they're someone else's dogs, but here we go. Okay, welcome. I bet this is the correct presentation. That is for the module two, right? Yes, we are module two. Okie dokie. Let's have the full presentation. Welcome. This is our class number three. 
We are making a review of the simple present structure. And to do that, yeah, definitely we need a subject for the sentence. Not necessarily has to be a pronoun. It can be my father, my son, my best friend, somebody, right? Somebody who does an action, my school, my friends, my family. So these are just to summarize the subjects, right? So that's why I put this pronoun. And then the action, which is the verb and the complement, right? So this is how we create affirmative sentences. But we have to take into consideration that for he, she, and it, the verb needs an S. Most of the time, an S, but sometimes ES, right? Or IES. It depends on the spelling. I shared with you the, the rules yesterday, so we got to be careful. When we create affirmative sentences with these three pronouns, with these three subjects, actually. Okay? So this is kind of the structure just to review. And of course, the objective for this class to say affirmative and negative sentence using the simple present. Remember that we also have the auxiliary do not, don't, or does not, doesn't, right? So for the negative sentences. And of course, we're going to try to describe our daily routine. So saying routine, <laughs> okay, some people say, <laughs> I'm up to my head, you say. <laughs> okay, I'm up to my ears of work. <laughs> yes, I know, it happens. But we have to, you know, try to be optimistic and definitely, right? And of course, we ask questions, right? We ask questions and we meet the auxiliary do or does. But some people were having a this big struggle today with these questions. <laughs> okay, I know. It's kind of uh, interesting that you insist and that you, and that you uh, keep, you know, trying until you get it correct. That's that's okay. Sometimes uh, it's kind of frustrating. I understand, but it's okay. It's fine that you keep trying until you get it correct because you want to get it correct. And you were respecting the structure, so don't worry, okay? Sometimes it's of the settings, you know, when we create a um, material virtually, sometimes we just don't get probably one symbol or something very minimum, but it's all right. So this is the question structure. This is something that we're also gonna review, okay? But the first thing I want you to talk, so I need you to talk, is not just me talking, 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 but the students trying to create their examples. So saying affirmative in negative sentence using action verbs, right? Get up, take the bus, cook lunch, play a sport, okay, take out the garbage, clean the house, watch TV. Probably now you don't watch TV anymore. You watch movies or sitcoms or talk to somebody or call somebody on the phone or work. That is another very common action we do have. Okay, um, ride a motorcycle, ride a bike, drive a car, any of these actions that you do every day, okay? So for example, I say I get up early every day. I don't get up early on Sundays. I take the bus to school, I don't drive, okay? So this is what you're gonna do. Try to combine two sentences, but one has to be affirmative and the other one has to be negative, right? And then try to describe your daily routine. Okay, when you say your daily routine, probably the most common activities, right? What time you get up, what time you go to work, what time you start working, what time you finish working, what time you usually have lunch, what are the most common activities that you do during the day? Yes? You study English, that is part of your routine. Then you study English very late at night, which is like really wonderful because not everybody wants to study at this time. So you make that big effort and that is really, really admirable, okay? so. Is the activity clear or do you have any question? No? 
No, no questions. Okay, perfect. I'm going to get this screenshot for you to talk and I'm going to put it in the WhatsApp group. Then these are the examples, but of course you can create more sentences, okay? Combining affirmative and negative and then try to describe the routine to your partner. When you finish, your partner is going to describe the routine for you and you're going to practice. That way we're going to be talking and we're going to be creating sentences. Yes. Yes or yes. Okay. <laughs> All right. Let me just, yeah, let me just get the screenshot and put it in the chat. One second, please. Okay. One second only. I just need the screenshot because of my computer. Sometimes kind of, here we go. One second, one second. This is the group, uh, this is number two, right? Number two, number two, number two. Let me find it. Yeah, here we go. Please do it. Okay, now I'm going to make the groups. What do you prefer, in pairs or in trios? Tell me. Groups of three for more participation. All right. Hmm. Yes, groups of three. Well, some groups are made of four. I'm going to create more groups then. Yes. Here, yes. Here you go. Try to practice as much as possible, okay? As much as possible. Hi. You couldn't move to any room. Hello. Hola, hola. Hello. Hi. Hello, teacher. Hi, how are you? Irma, are you here? Hello, Irma. Hello. Melissa, you want to participate in another group? Um, Casi no puedo hablar inglés, así que me cuesta entender. No problem, pero puede intentarlo. You can try. Ok. Ok. Lo voy a asignar en, en otro grupo. Ok. Está bien. Please, go to... Mandar al group number... One. Ok. Mr. Manuel Romero, good evening.
Eso. Eso, por ejemplo, yo me despierto a las seis de la mañana. Un ejemplo, es un daily routine de ustedes que están, perdón, ustedes que están comenzando. Yo me despierto, un ejemplo, a las seis de la mañana. Se lo digo en español solo para que más o menos entiendan el contexto. Me despierto a las seis de la mañana, después de eso... Eh, me levanto, porque una cosa es despertarse y otra cosa es que esté de huevo uno a la hora que se levanta, ¿verdad? Mm. Obviamente. Entonces, me despierto a las 6 de la mañana, después me levanto a eh, media hora después, eh, tomo un baño, después tomo el desayuno, eh, eh, a, a las 8 de la mañana salgo de mi trabajo, tomo el autobús, etc. Eso es, eso es la, el daily routine. Entonces, Traten de siempre, eh, traten de armar la oración en base a lo que ustedes hacen. Y si tal vez no es igual, porque les cuesta expresarse, inventen algo sencillo, no cuesta. Por ejemplo, en mi caso, I wake up at 6 a.m. After that, I take a shower around 30 minutes after I, I, uh, I wake up. Por ejemplo, ya me entiendo, o sea... Me desperté a las 6 de la mañana, después de eso, media hora después, tomo un baño. Eh, moreover, I, solo vean mis gestos. Moreover, I brush my teeth. I brush my teeth. Creo que me están entendiendo, ¿verdad? Aunque, sí, no, sí, sepan, aunque, no, ah, okay, aunque no sepan qué estoy diciendo. I brush my teeth. Eh, moreover, I take a bath. Tomar el Weekend? Weekend is sa Saturday or Sunday? Um, every day. Okay. okay. You study? Uh, yeah. No, study. Um, the, um, 6 a.m. o 9 a.m. In the university? Yes. In you, Cesar? What? I, I work, I used to work to 8 a.m. Every day. A, 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 at, o si voy a estar alguna mejor, at to, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, 5, I got to. What time got to university? Uh, university in the six. Six, six o'clock and at um, eh, no, no, creo que ya va a venir la mis por acá. Sí. <laughs> hello, hello. Any questions? Hello. Any questions? Everything fine? Everything correct? 
Yes. Eh, yes. Solo que, solo que eh, quisiera ser honesto. <ríe> me, me cuesta pronunciar para las palabras y... No problem. It's okay. Sí. Eh, me equivoco. Eh, quiero intentarlo, ¿verdad? Aprender. Try, exactly. Try. Ok. okay. No problem. Thank you. All right. Excuse me. Sí, ya se fue, creo. <ríe> bueno. Mmm, para, para decir me levanto sería hay terapia. ¿Verdad? ¿Cómo? Para decir me levanto, me levanto, me baño. Como la dramática al final es un poco, o sea, no siempre hay una pequeña diferencia. Sí. Poco a poco le va uno a la, eh, agarrando como la línea, la gramática también. Eh, a veces es confusa, pero se aprende, se adapta. Sí, eh, <coughs> en el caso decía que eran afirmativas y negativas. <coughs> Más que todo podría ser, para la, porque negativas sí creo que no hemos dicho. Podemos ver como que en el ejemplo aparece de que I get up early every day, pero después hace la negativa como de eh, no me levanto temprano los domingos. Entonces como que se puede decir una afirmativa y una negativa dentro de la misma, en el sentido de en la misma línea. Por ejemplo, um, Um, I, I get up early uh, for my work. Uh, y la ne hi. Hi, hi, do you need any help? Huh? Do you need any help? Eh, no, es que tenía problemas con el internet, entonces. It's okay, yeah. but everybody's participating. Sí. Eh, Did you Brenda create the estaba, sentences? Que... Yes, affirmative yes, sentences, yes. negative sentences, your daily routine. Sí. Yes. Tratado, sí. We try, we try. It's okay. No problem. We try. Yes, we're gonna we're gonna listen to the examples, okay? Okay. All right. Okay. Andai, tú primero. Me las puedo. Pico. I no hacer es I make. Creo que pulsera es como bracelets. Okay. Limpieza como cleaning, I cleaning my house eh, the weekend. Uh -huh. The Sunday, clean, clean the house. And do it. 
How do you say I said do? Yes. Yes, I do. Yes. I do. The homework. I do exercise. Yes. Melissa does bracelet. Really? She makes every day. Yes, right. She makes bracelets. So she lives in South City. I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> I, don't know. I, I, I imagine because of the picture. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes. Or Malecon. Uh -huh, because the people who live near the beach, they usually make bracelet, necklace, earrings, and this type of, of jewelry. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Only Miss Kenny Pino has the camera on. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what happened? Why are you so shy? <laughs> Nothing. Melissa. Uh -huh, and this is their small group. You can have more confidence for participation. Okay, did you finish creating the affirmative and negative sentences in the daily routine? Yes. Okay, yes. good. Nice. I think we're gonna finish, okay? So we're gonna return to the main session. Teacher. Yes. Te decía Carla y Andrea de que mm -hmm. pues nomás diciéndoles de que no, no, no tengan pena de preguntar, pues igual para exactly. todos, ¿verdad? De que todos estamos aquí para aprender y que pues no se vayan a bloquear porque de repente usted está y todo el mundo, <ríe> muchos están como haciendo de interrogación, ¿verdad? Question. <ríe> Ajá, entonces que también que no tengan pena porque es el grupo para preguntar, etcétera, etcétera. Yes, it's okay. It's fine. Pero eso es. I mean, you are just module two. It's understandable. Si se entiende, okay? At this point, maybe we need to learn more vocabulary, and that's okay. Yeah. Of course. And you can check the examples, obviously, in the platform. The examples, if you see, they are very similar. Very, very similar. Okay, so don't worry, you can use the same vocabulary, right? Yeah. Um, and we've been practice, this is the third class. So we've been practicing on Monday, on Tuesday, and today on Wednesday, the same topics. Yes, the same structure, so no problem. All right, I saw you were practicing and yes, it's, it's a bit difficult, but it's okay, it's doable. So, eeny, meeny, miny, mo. let's start. <laughs> okay, tell us a little bit about your routine. Because in the groups, it's a small group, so you should have a lot of confidence with your partners. Maybe you're not like really good friends because you don't know each other for a long time, but it's still okay. So, I'm going to explain. I'm going to give you examples of my routine. As I told you, the most common activities, okay? So you don't need to go like very specific each of the activities, but the most common. So I usually get up at 5.30. I try to, you know, prepare my breakfast. I usually uh, go to work about 6.30. I usually have breakfast in my car, so while I'm driving, that, that is not correct, I know, 
but that's how I do it because I consider it saves me time. So I usually get to work about 7.30 and I start working at 8 or 10 minutes to 8. I usually have lunch at 12, 12.15, it depends. I finish, well, I sometimes have a break at 3. I finish uh, work at 5. I come home about six because, you know, because of the traffic, as I told you. So when I get home, I have dinner. Now that we have these classes, I have dinner at six. Then I work a little bit on the computer, checking emails. Then I start teaching at eight. Okay, I teach from eight to nine, from nine to 10. So I go to bed around 11 because I have to upload the videos. Yes, so uploading videos sometimes take a little bit of time. It depends on the internet connection, but that is on weekdays. On weekends, it's different. On weekends, I get up late, I don't prepare breakfast. I sometimes go out for breakfast. I sometimes go to the supermarket. I sometimes go to the church. I clean the house. I do the laundry. I take out the garbage. I sometimes work in the garden. I sometimes uh, just take long naps. I sometimes just watch movies. I sometimes go out, sometimes visit new places. I like to go new places, so it's different, okay? But no les digo que lo hagan así de extenso. It's just an example como para darles más ideas, okay? I'm just saying five activities would be wonderful, yes? Si me quieren contar ya más, pues up to you. That's okay, yes? What's my favorite hobby? Oh, I have a lot of hobbies. I love reading books, but I like to get interested in reading books, I love to visit new places. That is my favorite. I love, I love to go to, I mean, the economy in our country is not enough so that you can go to different countries, but at least to different towns, to different places. There are some uh, cafes near Los Planes de Rendero. I don't really know the, the name. I think it's El Boulevard Orden de Malta. I guess that is the name of the place that you go up on the hill so the view of the city and the wing, it's so wonderful. So I love that place. So I like to go there, okay? I love watching movies, visiting my family. Yes, well, I don't live with my family, so my family is from Milo Vasco, so I like to go there and visit, talk to them. Sometimes my brother calls me, and he's like on the phone for a very long time. And I'm like, I, I have to work, I'm busy, you know? So whenever we get uh, together, we talk and talk and talk and talk nonstop. I have a lot of nieces and nephews, so I enjoy spending time with them too. Thank you for the question. That was a wonderful question. Okay, somebody, a volunteer, a brave volunteer, or we say names. <laughs> Miss Pino, I love your last name, actually, because it, it sounds like Pino, like a tree, like a pine. This is no volunteer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead, try, give your best. Um, I like, so... Uh, countries and places much place many places <laughs> many places okay and i visit uh, ataco beautiful and now we cycle beautiful. it's beautiful yes. sonsonate yes all these towns from sonsonate Huayu, ataco all those places are wonderful and the beach as well yeah i love the beaches as well 
Yes. Yeah. But tell us about your daily routine. What do you do every day? <laughs> and and week, I get up six a.m. Mm -hmm. and I I go to work seven eight, but no breakfast. In you this don't moment, have breakfast. I don't, I don't have, have breakfast. So you don't, don't have, have breakfast early. Yeah, no, no. Mm -hmm. I eat breakfast night, night o'clock, night at, a.m. At work. At work, yes, mm -hmm. yes, at work. And so. I my lunch. Like, I eat. I eat lunch. I eat. Or I no, have lunch. No. Merienda. Ah, snack. Ah, snack. <laughs> <laughs> so you have breakfast at nine, and then you have a snack. <laughs> yes. Uh, <laughs> my I eat. It's not 10 a.m. Uh -huh. <laughs> and 3 At p.m. Uh -huh. so. <laughs> That's good. The 3 is coffee and With bread. <laughs> and bread. Yes. And yes. a piece of bread. <laughs> okay. I like, I like the bread. Salvadorians love bread and coffee, or coffee and bread. <laughs> uh -huh. The coffee, how do you say tomo? I drink. I drink coffee in the morning and the, the afternoon. afternoon. Yes. How many cups? Two cups a day. Uh, two cups a day? Um, two. Two, two cups. cups. Okay. Two cups. Mm -hmm. I have a friend yes. that drinks like seven cups a day. No. <laughs> a lot of coffee. <laughs> yes, that's yes. a lot. Of... Good, Miss. It's Kino. much coffee. It's much. It's a coffee. lot of coffee. Good. Good job. Good try. Claps. Virtual claps for you. All right. Mm -hmm. Say a name. Usted tiene que nominar a alguien más. You have to say a name. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Teacher, teacher. Yes. yes. If, if you see everyone turn off the cameras to not participate. Yes. Dale, vamos a mandar el reminder. Yes. <laughs> it's a good idea. It's a good idea. I but know. not me. <laughs> choose, choose another victim, please. <laughs> the nets. Los que tengan la cámara apagada es porque están en pijama. No, no yet. Wearing pajamas. Hmm. Ok, the say next, a name. The next, the, next, participant. the next name is Daniel Toledo. Ok. Thank you. You welcome. Tell us. Um, I only work the whole day. All day. It's my life. That's <laughs> my life. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but you don't um, sleep at work. <laughs> no, I. Um, how do you say? Eh, dormir y trabajar a la vez. No sé cómo oh podríamos decir. Oh my goodness! <laughs> sleep and work at the same time. That's not possible. Uh, I think. Um, um, I get out early in the four and five I am. Wow, that's I super driving, early. Driving, I driving two hours for my work. Really? Or nice. three is um, depending on traffic. It depends on the traffic. Yes. Um, I work in the airport. At the airport. Yes. Um, I am a Conant. Um, and what time I you work, finish? I work um, 
to when I, I finish my work um six or seven night. And then you drive again to home. Yeah, drive again my home. Yeah. Um uh, I take the take my dinner. <laughs> dinner. Yes. You have dinner. Yes, I take my dinner and and then I you have classes. English. Yes. That's a it's very, very important on the, in, in But it's a day. very heavy routine. Yes, but yeah. it's okay. You're young. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Actually, I like your work. Yes, actually, yes, yes. if you love your work. Yes. The only probably tiring part is driving. Because <laughs> driving for three hours, it's a long drive. <laughs> Yes, yes, but um, it's um, mm, supportable. It's relaxing? Yes. <laughs> sometimes. Uh, when the view is sometimes. nice, when the view is nice, when there's not much traffic, you enjoy yes. driving. So you drive from the airport to Sonsonate, from the airport to Santa Ana, from the airport where? Sorry, repeat, where, please. Where do you drive? From the airport to San Miguel? Then, no. Um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Where do you live? I live in, in San Martin. In San Martin. Wow. Yeah. That's a long drive from the airport yes. to San Martin, from San Martin to the airport. Yes. Oh, that's right. Yes. It's because of the boulevard. Nah. Uh, <laughs> yes. Yes, but. Uh, it's the okay. The traffic is, it's. It's, it's on the opposite. And, yes. Mm -hmm. I know. Sometimes it happens. All okay. right. Let's Enjoy. <laughs> yes, you choose somebody else. Yes, you're going to um, give the opportunity to somebody else to practice. I I see uh, Oscar Aguirre. Oscar. Yes. <laughs> Mr. Aguirre. Mr. Yes. Aguirre is interested in participating. Yes. yes. True. Teacher, I can hear you so clear because my connection is on the stable. Really? Yeah. For the reason I, I can hear you so clear. You you want to choose somebody else? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Henry Lopez, the next victim. Because <laughs> I don't have any problem to share my <laughs> daily routine, right? Right. But Henry Lopez. Next Henry victim. Lopez, we don't know you, Mr. Lopez. Good evening. Good evening. Teacher. Compañero. Ya lo hemos visto. Ya lo conocemos. Eh, no. Es que no tengo cámara. Really? <laughs> I don't have a camera. Be honest. Eh, I'm sorry, I don't have a camera. Difficult in English. Eh, me cuesta. It's difficult. Pero no puede contar tres o cuatro de las más importantes activities that you do every day. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, my favorite hobby is playing soccer. Mm -hmm. uh, beside my grandfather in a coastal soul. Um, my favorite food and be soap and bring coffee. Coffee. Uh, coffee. Yeah, uh, bring coffee. What do you do? ¿Qué hace? ¿Qué se dedica? Eh, trabajo en ventas. I work en in sales. En es en vidri. Uh, okay, you can say I work in sales for a yes, eh, for a, a specific company. Mm -hmm. eh, tengo dificultad en el en el idioma. Eh. Are you practicing with the platform? Sí, estoy resolviendo los ejercicios de la plataforma. Yes. Okay, so you're going to learn vocabulary. I yeah. recommend you to take notes. Trate de tomar nota, de escribir, de escribir varias veces aquellas palabras que no se le quedan. All those ideas yeah. le pueden ayudar, como para recordarlo, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Thank you. Y muy pronto voy a tener la cámara. Please, <laughs> please buy a new camera. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay.
it's okay. O at least, at least puedo, puedo poner también una foto. Así cuando yes. ustedes no tienen la cámara encendida, al menos se ve la foto, no se ve solo la, la, la palabra ahí, or la, el oh, name. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Exactly like Melissa, you see? When she turns off the camera, there's a photo with her boyfriend, I guess. Yes. <laughs> but, yes. but sin filtro. Ah, pues sí, no, no, mira, be honest, be real. Excuse me. Be real. Without ah. filter. Exactly, without filters. Simply everybody gets filters on their pictures. And what yes. happened to Mr. Cesar? By the way, Mr. Mm. Cesar Vidal, you have a camera, don't lie. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Tell and us. And I usually get up to 5 p.m. Uh, I take a breakfast to 6 a.m., 6 half a.m. Mm -hmm. I, I go to work to 7 a.m. I start work at 8, 8 a.m. And the weekend, I usually, oh, sometimes, uh, visit my family, go to church mm -hmm. in the afternoon, and just That's all. Clean in my house, you know, <laughs> see movies, uh, listen music. Nice. You see, that was wonderful, Mr. Vidal. Vidal is not your last name, it's your second name, right? Yes. So you're Mr. Cáceres, actually. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And what do you do? I mean, what, do you, what is your occupation? You have a business, you work for a company. I, I work to a company. I, I am an accountant. Oh, you're an accountant. So we have accountants in this class. Hmm. Uh, o sea, como diría, como encargado del área de ingresos, o como, como manager. So, um, the account, I mean, yeah, you can say specifically, like, I'm the manager of the accounting area. Mm -hmm. um, or, or I manage. I manage the accounting area. I'm the manager in the accounting area of the company. That's okay. All right. So, we're going to have some help with the taxes. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Taxes declaration is coming, <laughs> believe me. Uh, yeah. Ah, something I have to it's do. Coming. Yeah, it's coming. Definitely. Okay, who's next? Um, Aldair Castillo. Yay! <laughs> He's been very excited <laughs> to participate. <laughs> Are you practicing, Mr. Castillo? Your microphone, please. Siempre se me olvida. Yo pienso esto. que lo hace a propósito para practicar, para ver cómo él se escucha primero. <laughs> No, siempre se me olvida. You don't do it on purpose. I know, it's, it's only a joke. Go ahead. No, pues, eh, incluso también en un juego. Ah. Siempre se me olvida. Y no se graba la respuesta. Pero bueno, okay, sí. Go ahead. Eh, I get up at 6.45 a.m. And I take a shower, I get dressed. And after I brush my teeth and go to work on my motorcycle. And <clears throat> in the morning, I I do say, 
eh, ¿cómo se dice? I Hago algunas exercise? gestiones. Oh, ah, no. I make some errands. <laughs> I, I make a... Some errands. Some errands? Errands, yes, it's like gestiones. Uh -huh. eh, I eat my lunch eh, at noon. Mm -hmm. To uh, one one p.m. Mm -hmm. uh, in the afternoon, I continues uh, make Working. other errands. Other uh -huh. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And <clears throat> I come back to my home at six p.m. And in the night, I watch TV, I visit my mom. My mom uh, live near? Lives near. To me? Yes, lives near here, near, you can say. Uh -huh, near my house. Oh, near here? Mm -hmm. uh, that's all. That's all. And then you study. <laughs> uh, yes. yes, I study, I practice, <laughs> I talk to my friends, yes, on a video conference. It's okay. Great, good job. Someone else, we still have time for somebody else. Okay. And where? Do you want to Mario Caña, nunca, nunca ha hablado. Really, no conocen a Mr. Caña. ¿Cómo han esperado tanto tiempo? Maybe, maybe, maybe. Nice to meet you, Mr. Caña. Ahí está. ¿Cómo no te veo, Mr. Yo, yo no conozco a ese señor. No Okay. <laughs> ah, he's your friend. Okay. Okay, tell us, I Mr. Up, okay. I get up at 5 and 6 a.m. and write to my work. Um, I am a general accountant in a in a company. Uh, I return to my house at 7 or 8, or 8 p.m. I eat my diner and um, play with my daughters. Do you have daughters? I have, yes. I, I How have, many? Uh, I, have, I have two two beautiful daughters. Oh, that's so cute. Uh, she, she they are. Um, terremoto. They are? <laughs> they are terremoto. They are, they are, they are uh -huh. terremoto. No sé cómo decir terremoto. Es cuadro. Like, cuadro. Yeah, earthquakes. Earthquakes. Uh -huh. okay. Yeah, earthquakes. <laughs> Um, well, you can say they are hyper, hyperactive. <laughs> yes. I go to bed, to bed at 11 and 8 um, at night. Nice. On weekend to, to visit my uh, mother-in-law. Your mother-in-law, the mother uh, of your wife. She lives mm -hmm. in um, Holocuenta. Wow, so you have pupusas for breakfast. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Olo, All is beautiful. Every weekend you have pupusas for Every breakfast. Every weekend. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> That's all. Congratulations. That's all. That's a good job. Okay. Bueno, extrañamos a aquellos que no quisieron participar. <laughs> we miss you. <laughs> Okay, Miss uh, Karen Portillo, Miss Brenda Escobar, Miss Carla Flores, Miss Melissa Flores. Are you sisters? No. <laughs> Miss Andrea Machuca. So we miss your participation. Try to participate. The more you can, the best. Definitely, right? Yeah. So, yes, sir. They will be the next meeting in the next Class. Or tomorrow, exactly. Una, yep. presen una presentation by us <laughs> with the PowerPoint and everything. No, teacher. Ah. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> ah, you see? <laughs> right. Uh -huh. 
But it's because of the time, probably. They are sleepy already. They don't want to participate. But tomorrow, you will be the first one, okay? You will be the first ones to participate, okay? So, I'm just going to show you something right here. There are some examples of people talking about their schedules or daily routine. You have this information also on the platform. I saw it. So you already have an example of how to describe your schedule, right? So we have Britton, David, Joshua Burns, and the other guy. Hold on one second, please. Let me just move this screen right here. Oh, Maya Black, right? So they, they talk about their schedule. Schedule, it's a kind of difficult word to pronounce, so that's why I say daily routine, right? Okay, so my classes start at 8, so I get up at 7, I take the bus to school. When do your classes end? They end at noon, then I have a job at the library, so when do you study? My only time to study is in the evening from 8 until midnight, so kind of similar to your case, right? And then we have Joshua Burns and Maya Black. Obviously, their cases are different. So that's why I told you, your personal cases are different because we have different jobs, different activities, different actions that we make every day, right? So we're going to stop here. I hope you keep practicing, you keep learning and acquiring and accumulating more vocabulary. Big effort, big job. Okay, great work. Keep pushing and working hard, and I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay. Teacher. Yes, sir. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> Teacher, how can I do yes. all the la plataforma? The the mistake, the problem. Yeah. Sí, porque al final el... al final no hubo solución para ese mistake. Fíjese que lo que pasa que Cómo es de contradictorio porque si le pongo si le pongo la puntuación correcta me da correcto perdón y me incorrect. da incorrecto mm -hmm. pero si la pongo si la pongo incorrect. incorrecta me da que está bueno el problema yeah. es el problema es que las demás están haciendo lo mismo uno y me sigue dando incorrecto no sé si solo es a mí o a todo el mundo no I saw that everybody was having that issue uh, tonight, I don't promise to do anything, but tomorrow I'm going to call uh, the manager. I'm going to call somebody that is in charge of that platform, okay? Because I wish I could do more. Así me gustaría poder hacerle más, pero I'm not in charge. No soy a cargo de eso. Entonces, de verdad que quisiera poderles ayudar, but in this moment, it's kind of hard for me to do it, okay? So okay, I will so. call tomorrow. Yes, I will resend your message. Okay, Miss Brenda Escobar, nice to meet you. At the <laughs> end. <laughs> At the end, just to say goodbye good and good night. <laughs> okay, bye. Take yes. care. Blessings. Bye. 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 Take care. bye. bye. Good night.